Today in this video, we're going to show you the paper transition effect. You can use this effect as a transition or as an effect. To create this effect or transition, you need a paper rip image, which you can download from freepick.com, or you can use multiple images of crumpled paper or ripped paper to create your own. Now, let's jump into Filmora. First, place the footage on the timeline. Then, identify the point where you want to use this effect or transition. Now take a snapshot. Right-click on the snapshot and select Reveal and Explore, and it'll open the saved location of the snapshot. Now right-click on the snapshot and open it in Photoshop, and open the Paper Rip PNG image as well. Now, copy the Paper Rip image and paste it onto the snapshot. Now, place the snapshot layer above the Paper Rip image, then hold the Alt key on the snapshot and create a clipping mask. Now select the snapshot and change the blend mode to screen. Now to make it darker, select the Paper Rip image, and from the adjustment layer, select Levels, and adjust the levels to make it darker. Also, the crumple marks now should be more visible. Now select all the layers and press Ctrl plus E to merge all the layers and save the snapshot. Then go back to Filmora and apply the snapshot on track 2 and keep the snapshot for 5 or 6 frames long. And your effect is ready. In a similar way, you can use different paper rip styles to create different variations in the effect and transition. Now to enhance the effect and transition, add a sound effect. And for that, we'll go to the Audio tab, and then to Sound Effects, and from the search bar, you can search for the sound effect. Like, you could use a camera shutter sound, a rolled up paper sound, and then add some nice music according to the video, and you're all done. Now let's render the footage to see the preview. That's it. Download Filmora now and start creating amazing effects in Filmora. See you in the next video.